In this video, I'm going to show you how to do this anaconda pattern, which snakes around the cube in a continuous line on a 3x3 three three Rubik's Cube. Check out my other video showing you how to solve a 2x2 two two Rubik's Cube, a 3x3, three three, a 4x4, four four, and even a 5x5. Five five. So to do this pattern, you do need to start with a solved Rubik's Cube, so you need to know how to solve a Rubik's Cube or have a solved Rubik's Cube. And you need to know how to use algorithms on a Rubik's Cube too. If you don't already know how to use algorithms, then check out my 3x3 tutorial on how to solve a Rubik's Cube. So to do this pattern, we need to use an algorithm. And that algorithm is L U B I U I R L I B R I F B I D R D I F I. So let's do that then. They go L u b i u i r l i b r i f b i d r d i f i and that gives us this anaconda pattern To undo this pattern, you want this cube like this. You see where these colors meet at this point here. You want this in the top right, so this is our front face. And as before, rather than learning an algorithm to undo this, I prefer just to use the same algorithm if possible. And we can, we can just do the same algorithm two more times and that will undo this and set it back to a completed Rubik's Cube. So where these meet, this is the top right. Let's do the same algorithm again. We go L U B I U I R L I B R I F B I D R D I F I We've still got the same pattern, but the colours have rotated. And if we do it one more time, we will get a completed Rubik's Cube. L U B I U I R L I B R I F B I D R D I F I. And there we are back to a completed Rubik's Cube. Hope it helped, guys, and thanks for watching. For more Rubik's Cube patterns, check out my other videos. And also, if you know of any other Rubik's Cube patterns that you'd like me to make a video of, then feel free to leave a comment in the comment section with the algorithm, and maybe I'll make a video of that in the future. Thanks a lot, guys. Bye.